Hey everybody, how's it going? It is Extreme Time. We're back with some more Ark Survival Evolve on the modded Extreme Pooping server. Hope you guys are having a wonderful day. I'm having a fabulous day myself. We're back on the prowl in search of the Dire Bear. And there's one more place that i uh, yet to check. Bro, I flew past it, but I haven't thoroughly checked it. And it's this temple right here. We're gonna see if we can get us a dire bear today. Thank you guys for coming by and chilling out with me. If you enjoyed this video, make sure you hit that thumbs up button. And if you're new, make sure you subscribe for more daily arc content. I've been doing mostly arc for now, but we'll get into other things later. If you got any suggestions on what I should be playing? Drop me a comment. I do read all of the comments. Bucks, bucks. All right, so I flew past here. I didn't actually come in here and see anything but bugs. Oh, what is this? Oh, they put an obelisk here. Nice. Oh, getting attacked. Um, hello? Okay. Nom 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 nom. Stupid bugs. All right, let's continue on. I didn't know they added another obelisk or summon thing. Let's see here. We got carnals. We got these dilos, dodos, parasaurs. What else have we here? Trikes. More parasaurs. Just sounds like so close, but it's not. And what else do we have here? Trikes. Yeah, we see trikes. Packies. If you're not a bear. Oh. No. I was saying, if you're not a bear, you're gonna die. More compies. Parasaur. No. No. So, no bears. As we got. Let's go and see if we can't search the other side of this wall. Well, some of these places you can't fly through. That would be good. Okay. Still no sign of bears. Parasaur. More parasaur. I think they fixed some of the collision issues here. Looks like it. And, yeah. Basically, fly through most of the stuff now, which is cool. Alright, so no bears here. Well, we're gonna continue searching. Hopefully. By the end of this episode, we'll find a bear. Alright, we'll bring it back when we find something more interesting. Alright guys, we are back. And finally, after years and years of torturous searching, I think we finally found one. Let's take a look at what level this sucker is. 56, good lord. I don't want to kill it just because this is the only one I've found in the entire server. I should look up what to do or how to do a dino wipe. That might help. So I'm going to take this guy. We're at. Oh, we're right by this monkey temple thing. Let's see. Let's take a look at the map here. I'm going to go kind of this way. I'm going to bring him back to the taming pen and then we'll get him tamed up and everything. I'm like, what's the word? I'm kind of excited and I'm kind of not just because this guy has literally made me pretty angry. Just because 
took so long to find his. You're gonna get ooh, legendary. Eighty-four. You're lucky I got something on tow. I would have killed you right there. All right, so we're gonna take him back down, get him into the taming pen, and we'll be back in a moment. All right, we made it back. We're gonna park this guy into the taming pen and uh, we get him all tamed up. And first time go, yes. All right, let's get my tranks out here. Today we are going to be using the Dream Machine sniper rifle. I know it's been a while since I've used this thing with all the underwater adventures and stuff going on. What's up? You ready to be a super cool tamed bear? Get one shot in the body. And he's down already. Here we go. We've already got the kibble. Here. Carnal kibble. Go ahead and drop some carnal kibble on him. Let's see. 4300 torpor, so it's going down gradually, so it shouldn't uh, be too big of an issue. He should tame up fairly quickly. He should not need any narcotics at all. So let's kind of see what we got anyway with our narcotic situation. Pop up in here. Take a look at what we got. About 5,000-ish narco berries here. Some of which are still at 100 times. I'll go ahead and get the move in to here. 1100 more narcotics. And then hopefully the 100 times narco gets converted to the regular one narco soon. Alright, let's see if we can get some more berries from this guy. Do a couple swings. There we go. Freezing the game up. It is what we do. Get another swing on this side. There we go. All those berries. Well, also, for some reason, though, however, I'm not getting as many berries as I should be. Just strange. I should be getting at least 5,000 narco berries from a couple of swings like that. So, I don't know, did my um, gathering rate go down? I'm trying to get the rest of these into here, and this one will produce our. Oh. Oh, I was in the wrong inventory. There we go. Now we should be in the right one. Nope, not that one. This one. There we go. It's going to produce about 5,300 um, berries, and then uh, we'll drop that in there. Get some gamma action here. Can't see a darn thing. Water is full. Let's check this guy out. Has he eaten yet? Oh, he's almost tamed up. Plus 27 levels. So that'll be a 63 dire bear. We're going to have to look and see. Well, we need to get the uh, saddle going. I think it's on my person. No one's sure. Oh, let's see. Saddles. What is that? Tyrannodon, Argentavis, Trike, and Terrorbird. Nope, it looks like it's going to be in the smithy. So, let's pop in here. We've got a smithy here that we can take a ch look at. A gander at. Casteroides. No, did I learn it? Ah, maybe I need to learn it first and then we'll be able to do it. Alright, so I think it's in the person. Diabaris out of container needs. Hide and fiber. Hide and fiber. I think we've got plenty of that. Right here. And let's 
go for some fiber. Swing. And there we go. Looks like we've got everything to make a die bear saddle. We can make two of them. You ready to be tamed up, homie? One more bite. See how far his food levels dropped. It's gonna need to drop about 30 more points before we can actually run around with that guy. And get some good tests going here. Let's see. Should be very, very soon. about 25 more points let's see what kind of issues we can get into here so the manta that we found earlier was just like swimming up in here maybe we can find another manta i don't know enough if i'm down for taming another one maybe if it's a low level we'll uh check it out let's see what we've got in here we've got little turtles we've got a swimming parasaur Let's see what happens when I punch it! And he's on the run. So, what is that over there? It looks. Um, might be just a lighting glitch over there. Alright, so we're gonna hit back. Should be just about ready to tame up. Or be tamed. Oh. A ham sandwich? What is this? Why is there another building here? Who owns this thing? Why did he... Why? Ham sandwich. Ooh, there's a fight over there. Let's go ahead and demolish this structure. Was he trying to tame copies or something? I don't know. No, but we're gonna miss my guy there. Well, I got all the materials out of that, so let's head over. Check out the die bear. Sprint mode, baby. And there he is, our level 83 die bear. It's totally off on my my calculations my math isn't very good today folks all right so we're gonna have to take him out of there and we're gonna have to lose some of this stuff so let's give it all over to you bring the dire bear out of there we got a saddle on him already. Let's go ahead and check out what kind of stats we got on this boy, bad boy. Not like super bad boy, but 1500 health, 800 stamina. And looks like 800 weight, 315 melee, 226 movement speed. Yeah. I've heard these guys can get up and go. Oh man, look at that stamina. It's not even going down real quick. Oh, there we go. Full speed. See, his swim speed's pretty slow. It's fine and normal. Get some attacks going here. Nom nom. Munch, crunch. And he should be able to gather. Yes, he can gather. Um. Meat. Without issues. And we can get. I wonder if there's a difference between so with biting it we get 209 fiber out of 2 or 111 there so let's swing swinging with the claw gets you another 100 or so I think it's about the same I think the swing just gets you an AOE damage and no no tree products So yeah, he's pretty good at gathering both berries and meat. Let's get him some melee damage here. Make him a super battle. 
for Battle Bear. Run and gather, pretty good. He eats a lot. He's eating men um berries like crazy right now. And his stamina is still about halfway. This guy's pretty cool. Probably didn't get his butt whooped by the strike here if the strike's a high level. Let's see. 112. Take a look here. Not super high on gathering, but it's all good. We we'll get some more melee damage going here. Let's see what we got for. Let's get the struggle away. So yeah, overall this bear at low level is a great find. I mean you can do so much about as good at gathering, gathering berries as a trike and as good at gathering meat as probably a raptor. Let's see. Get some smacks in. Oh yeah, kill that 280. Six hundred and thirty melee damage, and he's pretty burdened. We're gonna have to drop some of this junk, so we can pump its health by eating meat, and then he can recover by eating berries, or no, maintain his hunger by eating berries. Is where I was getting at here, and he's good to go. We can drop some of this meat. I'm still a little bit weighed. Let's uh, get rid of some of these berries. We'll keep the fiber. Yeah, let's not keep anything. We can always gather more. Let's rock and roll here. Let's take out this trike again. Come on, Trike, get some! Oh, that was a 400. Nice. So, yeah, these guys are pretty... Pretty good at fighting. Didn't take very much damage from that Trike. Level 400 is Trike. And there we go. Full speed sprint. Can we jump? No. Alright. Oh, uh, we can we can stand up and roar. Okay, that's cool. So the crouch button makes him stand. All right, we're back here. We're gonna get this guy and take him to um, our base of operations. Let's go ahead and power up this thing. Should be. Oh, he made it in. And let's see if the Quetzal will make it in. And we're good to go. We are back at base with our new Dire Bear. Hopefully, at some point, um, they'll fix the spawn rates and I'll be able to find a better one. Oh, what are you doing, Quetz? Still got to rename the Quetzal. Don't particularly like the name Goose Pickle. I don't even know where I got that name from. It's just like popped in my head and the combination just went. Alright, let's see if we can uh, get you guys teleported into base. Oh, they both went. That's good. Now, let's see if you can teleport me. And we're inside our base. Good to go.
All right. Hopefully at some point we'll find you a, a significant other and then we'll be able to make some babies. Some baby bears. Some cubs. Let's get use Pico out of there. And finally, folks, finally we have found our elusive dire bear and it's been I don't know how many episodes have I been trying to get this bear it's just crazy so let's take a look over here and see what we got as far as time here I need to work on getting some kind of timer at all time, like every time I press the button. And... So, let me show you guys what we were working with here. So, during our um, incident and messing around and goofing around with the Manta, we made this thing right here, which is the taming box that uh, BTC, aka Blame the Controller, made on his tutorial video um, I tried it it works however I'm still like the high level ones they would still smash right through your armor so I mean even though this thing works it's still not effective here on Valhalla um, we've got to find some kind of better armor maybe some ascended uh, stormtrooper armor but even my ascended flak chest was getting smacked maybe in two or three hits from a high level manta but if we could figure out something to uh get those high level mantas tamed up then i may go back and tame them but as it is now they are too powerful to try to tame um on f on uh manually so if i don't know Passive teams really suck, especially for these mantas since they're super highly aggressive. But anyways, folks, that's going to be it for today's episode. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, make sure you leave a like, smack that thumbs up button for me, please. And if you're new, make sure you subscribe for more daily content. So we're going to head off over here. We're going to get ready to start streaming this afternoon and get some... Uh, get some stuff going I think we've got our PvP battle arena going I think uh, that's gonna be a thing this afternoon so if you're around well, this video is probably gonna come out after the live stream so if you're around make sure you check out that recap of the live stream and anyways hope you guys have a great and wonderful day we'll see you in the next video